Hello and welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to review this Halloween 45 Years of Terror's Michael Myers bobblehead that I picked up from Halloween 45 this past uh, weekend. And actually it's limited to 500 and mine is number 304. I missed the Halloween 3 uh, Tom Atkins uh, figure. So I decided to get this one and also got the exclusive poster. I showed, I made a video uh, two days ago, two, three days ago that I um, show you all, all my haul that stuff that i picked up from the event to make sure to check that out i'm going to put that at the end uh but i decided to make a separate video for this uh awesome bobblehead and go over the details everything more up close and stuff the box looks really good i like that they hand write it uh, limited number uh, with 304 from 500 i'm going to bring it uh, closer so uh, we can see how the box looks real quick uh here's the front of the box you can see it says uh royal bubble in the top halloween exclusive 45 stuff and here's the bubble head how it looks and here's the limited number and it really like that pumpkin that it comes with so i can't wait to see how it's how big it's going to look when i open it uh, here's the side halloween drop containers halloween and here's the uh, of course that poster art here's the bottom the back this is the basically how the statue i mean bubble head is going to look i believe it's made out of resin and lately i've been really liking the bubble heads i have i got like few for the collection uh, and here's the here's the other side i like this side my image looks really cool and the pumpkin right there really cool um, so yeah this is the box it looks really good i'm actually can't wait to uh, take it out of the box which i'm going to do right now i'm going to take it out so we can see uh, how the bubble head looks so let's get started all right here's the bubble head out of the box and it looks absolutely awesome love the clothing um the eyes and the face the sculpt um i'm very glad that i actually picked one up for the collection i really wanted a collectible from there even though i got shirts i got an art uh but this one really represents that event and i like that they put uh, halloween 45 years of terrors uh, on the base part which is pretty cool uh, i was actually thinking are they going to uh, put anything on the base or it's just going to be on the box but i'm glad they did that the only thing is that they haven't put uh, the limited number on the on the base or anywhere so it's, it only says uh, on the box so that's still cool but I, I wish they would put it on the let's say on the bottom of the uh, bubble head the base uh, but yeah it looks really good uh, I like the clothing the eyes uh, even though we don't really see Michael's eyes in the movie so this one is kind of shows but it's still pretty cool um, the pumpkin looks really well done it actually feels like it lights up the way the paint looks and when the light hits on it um, I'm gonna show the bottom of the base so you guys can see it just says royal bubbles no numbered or anything um but yeah it's a pretty cool thing you can see the pumpkin um and the head moves really good as you can see and uh the knife the blood right there looks wet which is nice actually the blood work looks good for the price range everything the paint job there's a side view Back. and here's the other side let me know if you pick up anything from the halloween 45 i picked up this and also the exclusive poster uh, which i can't wait to frame i have i showed everything on my uh all that I stuff that I picked up from the event. I'm gonna put the link in the at the end of the video so you guys can check it out. But I decided to uh, review this separately. Um, the eyes, you guys, let me just bring it closer. The eyes, so you guys can see. So yeah, it's actually. Uh, 
a pretty good figure let me know what you guys think uh, you guys collect uh, bubble heads i've been collecting them lately this past uh, couple months i got like the sam one i got the captain spaulding one from house of thousand corpses and now this and i feel like they look cool i don't collect bubble heads like all the time but if i see a really cool one um, i actually like them they look really good lately they're starting looking more accurate even um, so yeah i really like the captain spaulding one i reviewed it in the channel and the sound one as well so you guys want to check it out uh, but yeah let me know what you guys think about these bubble heads if you collect bubble heads and also if you guys went to halloween 45 uh, what did you guys picked up uh, i would like to know just decided to quickly uh, go over this bubble head and show you all uh, this is a uh, exclusive to the event so uh, i don't think i checked i don't think anywhere else they sell this i seen some already on the ebay uh for a high price it was like 100 or even 200 dollars which i feel like that's crazy for this uh, i think this was originally um i believe it was uh 35 dollars 30 35 if i'm not wrong um but yeah anything more than that i would say anything more than 40 it's like not worth it 40 50 the most i would say but you guys find it for 100 i would say it's not worth it but still it's a really cool uh bubble head statue i'm very happy can't wait to display it next to my uh other Meyer, michael myers collection and stuff that i have uh so yeah let me know your thoughts what you guys think about this and also feel free to like and subscribe for more unboxing and review videos and until next time i'll see you guys later